Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Elisa's Eats and today we are going to be making from Adventure Time Jake's bacon pancakes. Bacon pancakes, making bacon pancakes. This is something I really love. It's something I've done a lot before with my family in America. And then when I watched Adventure Time like years ago when he was making it, I was like, guys, we do that. It's really cool. So what we're gonna do is make that today. I'm so excited. It's so easy. And these are the ingredients you're gonna need. Let's do it. Adventure time. Take some bacon and I'll put it in a pancake. Bacon pancake. So to start this adventurous time, we're gonna grab all of our friends. You're going to need one and a half cups of self-rising flour with about half a teaspoon of baking powder. This is just to make them really nice and fluffy. Half a teaspoon of salt. One and a third cup of buttermilk. You can use another milk, but I find this really makes them delicious and moorish. Two tablespoons of melted butter. You're also gonna need extra for frying. One large egg at room temperature. Two tablespoons of caster sugar. One teaspoon of lemon zest. One teaspoon of vanilla bean paste. Now this honestly depends on how much bacon you want to appease the Jake gods with. Uh, you can go with the traditional American streaky bacon. I think that's what Jake would prefer. I really like shortcut bacon. So we're gonna make a bit of both. We're gonna make these into nice, long, dippy pancakes, and these ones into round, perfect pancakes and see which Jake likes better. So I've got about eight pieces of bacon, but I'm probably gonna fry some more later. It honestly depends if you want one or two bits of bacon per pancake. I really think Jake would want two, so maybe double the amount of bacon. But I've just fried these in a pan until they're nice and cooked. Depends on how, if you want your bacon crispy, I'd go for the streaky bacon and just cook it for longer. It's all up to you. This is your bacon pancake. You do you, bae. Let's get started. Adventure time. So what we're gonna do first, if you haven't cooked your bacon, cook your bacon to your liking, but also remember it's gonna slightly cook more when we put it in the frying pan as well. And so what we're gonna do is make our pancake mixture first. We're going to put our flour, sugar, baking powder and salt into a large bowl and whisk that together so there's no lumps. Then make a well in the center. Then we're going to add our egg, then our butter into the middle and slightly mix it together. Now, I'm slowly whisking it like this because if you add all the liquid in at once and then start to mix it, you've got a higher likelihood of getting lumps in your pancakes. And then I'm just slowly gonna drizzle the buttermilk while whisking until it's all incorporated, then add the vanilla and lemon zest. Make sure you whisk it really, really good. We don't want lumpy space princess here. So we're putting them on a medium to medium high heat to start off with. Putting about half a tablespoon of butter per pancake. Then I put the bacon in the pan first, then spoon some of the mixture on top. Now it's very thick, but when it hits the hot pan, it will spread. So don't put too much on like I did with this first one, but it still looks amazing. And then we're just gonna let it sit on a medium heat for about, half a minute to a minute until bubbles start to form on the pancake. Then we're gonna flip it around and cook for another half a minute or so. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. Oh, no. I mean, that actually bad. looks really good. That looks majestic, let's keep it. And then I'm also just putting them on a wire rack while they're cooling, just so that they don't get soggy on one side. Now, the thing I like about this pancake mix is because it's a bit thicker, you can help shape your pancakes while it's still in the pan after you just pour it. This just helps to make it look extra beautiful. Oh, oh my God. Oh. I'm loving the look of these. I think they're adorable. 
I know Jake will be so proud. Okay guys, that's how you make my bacon pancakes from Adventure Time. I hope these appease the Jake gods. They smell amazing. I'm so excited to eat these because it's bacon and pancakes and deliciousness. I say, let's eat. Now, we don't have Jake from Adventure Time per se, but we do have another dog. No, actually that's me. <laughs> Woof. <laughs> Can this dog get a bone? Come on. I love you. It's all right, just okay. pop it in. You get to try it first. It's a, a big boy bite. Yeah, oh, big, big oh boy my bone. goodness. <laughs> oh, they're so fluffy. They are. You get it. Mm. Well, the pancakes are beautiful. Mm. So fluffy. Oh, that lemon. I know you don't like lemon either. Sorry, this is not a good breakfast for you. But, oh, it's got that it's little... It's actually all right. It's got that little hint of, oh, there's something fresh and zesty. Mm. And then it's just like, oh, bake it. Did you like it? Uh, yes. Come back for seconds. Okay, good. It's just like, as long as a Jake likes it, I'm happy. <laughs> oh, oh. Mm. oh. Uh, make it, grab your friends, go to very oh. distant lands. Mm. Jake the human, and now I'll stop. Have adventures. Adventure time! <laughs> hey guys, thanks, thanks for watching, watching this video. video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more. And leave a comment in the section below so that we can make something you've always wanted to eat. Because I love it. <laughs> Bye. Preferably anime or something TV related or something like that or something awesome game related.